This has been cool, though. It's amazing what a, a little bit of time pressure does to how you, like, changes how you play games. Puts a little bit of excite, a little bit more excitement in it instead of just sort of pulling through. Stand down or die. Range spiders. More damage. Stand down or die. Down on me, idiot. Three melee projections. Mm, maybe. Ultimately, I don't think it makes any difference until we get the next um, next base upgrade. we fight through everything and then these guys are just here it's like hey we've been waiting for it. it's like why couldn't I come with you guys yes I see Out of here.
This build out of 10 game looks fantastic. Yep. Yeah. Let's hope I can um, play it well. At least give it some, give it a little bit of justice, right? Maybe some plot. Oh, you think I did the absolute best I could? I am trying the best I am. I can. I did better than you. I don't know, man. <clears throat> Pro gamer without hair is pretty good. It's a hard act to, to keep up with. Stand down or die. You never looked at builds and stuff, you don't want to ruin the fun by seeing how inefficient your own are. Yeah. Stand I can understand that. Or die. But I want to kill bosses and, you know, do the challenges and stuff and not get frustrated because I don't know how to do builds. I just want to play the game. Yeah. I'll always go in blind on day one though and do reasonably well because most games like this you can do almost whatever you want for the first x percentage of the game until it gets to a point where you've got to scale um, offenses and, def and defenses in the right direction you, you can get by with lower damage <laughs> low damage glass cannons uh, glass what, what would you call those um, they're not glass cannons they're glass pea shooters Um, you know, and you can, you know, if you play well and you avoid stuff and time your shots right. <laughs> yeah. What's that tiny little gun? Beretta? Is it a Beretta? You know those tiny little guns you see in the, the mob movies? Yeah, see if you can make a build that will run end game stuff, then that's that's probably good enough. I can't do that. Can I help you? Oops. And even if I could, like I, I just wouldn't find that much fun. Pocket pistols, glass pocket pistols. <laughs> nice. Dude, you brought me out here and I wasn't <laughs> ready to go. Rude. How do we get back Take to? Care. Wherever. As long as you can have dual pocket pistols, well that's I think that's a that's worth fighting for.
Where's my other quest? It's here, isn't it? The harbour. There it is. That's, um, yeah, you should put those in. The more games that get nominated. I haven't played yes. either. I, I have both of them. I um, see. The, games that, the more games that get nominated, um, they get seeded. They'll get seeded as well. Welcome, traveler. Where is the person that's over here? Did yes. I speak to the wrong person? I see. Can I help you? Deep Harbor Don't Chief. Lose your way. Hmm? Gods be with you. Oh, is he back at the start of the zone? Maybe? Maybe? Well, I mean, for 100 points, you should redeem it. Although, to be fair... Like... Oh, yeah, he was at the back of the zone. Lazy... Mother. Yes. Nothing. <laughs> there you go. It'll, it'll be seated highly. Two games, two redemptions. That's fair enough. Although, what happens if RE2 wins? I can't work. I haven't played RE1. That's alright. We'll just put the um, the nominations. There's two nominations for RE1. Help it help it get the that seed ranking. What was that? That that there was one game that we played a while ago because I wanted to play it, and like I was in, I was having tears by the end of the game. That would have worked well in the um, in the fields. The words, what? Well, yeah, lost words. That was right in your feels. That didn't just hit you in the feels. It like grabbed them and rotated them, squished them around a bit, and then hit you in them. It was good gameplay as well. Um, and then some, and some in interesting side mechanics in the story stuff. Pop them, twist them, boil them, mash them. Dude, yeah. Treat them like a speed bag. I had a. I was watching a bit more of that um, siege survival game. I think that would be an okay one. I'm not going to play it, but I think it would be an okay game. Hey. Oh, I got to go up that way. No, you're welcome, dude. Um, it was written by. I can never remember her first name. Uh, Terry Pratchett's daughter.
Yeah, clearly inherited his his wordy stuff. Have you played, um... What's the question? Man without hair? First third is the first E, but I don't know where the E box... Um... Ah, oh, yeah. <laughs> I think they go backwards. Like, they're the E box. You do a bit in the ruin at the start. It's funny, like we're like full slashing around and hacking up and die. killing monsters, and it just feels chill. Just chilling, la 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 la. la. <laughs> Yeah, this is my third character. <clears throat> the, the the standard thing happened with my first character. I got through like three acts or three chapters, you know, thirty percent of the game ish, and the character started to get real bricky. I'm like, that's it. Yeah. <clears throat> Make another character follow and guard. And just rocked it all the way home. It was great. I'd probably I'd be doing endgame on that character if it um, wasn't for this weekly tournament thing. And I think it's a great idea. I don't know if I'll do it every week. Maybe. I guess I'm just going to depend on the characters. Oh, and the um, <clears throat> the rule sets. Yeah, the crafting's really good. through invasion forces oh <gasps> I'm pretty sure I got killed by one of those yesterday <clears throat> and again with no actual move skill you can't hit the space bar and get out of it you have to you have to be moving straight away. <laughs> Last year has a terminacy crafting got removed from POE. <clears throat> yeah. This has gone on long enough. Be gone! Ah, yes. oh, I see you helped clear out the rabble down. I mean the stuff that was added temporarily. You Must be light mages. Yeah, they're pretty rough. I 
It's not hard to avoid them, but it becomes harder when you have uh, less movement abilities. But such is life. Let me in, sir. Clenchy. I think I had that point unspent for a long time. Oh, okay, nothing there, nothing there. Okay. Travel to Thetima. Doing okay, crew. We're approaching... Uh, approaching seven hours so far. Vast improvement over... Vast improvement over the first run. Or the first completion, but... That one we were reading the quests out and taking time. And it's definitely what I want to do is try to improve the um, the level time each time. Pretty sure even if you stun those um, 
whatever it is with the that bring that big death ball down. It still comes down. Kind of cool because it makes you like yeah. A lot of times with the effects, I don't want to check because it it's death. Um, <laughs> but yeah, a lot of times effects are like a, a warning, but I think that's a warning that it's already been summoned. It's on its way, so stand move. down or die. There's a lot of crabs there. You know, bear. Oh, got to charge the Lagonian guard. Try not to hurt yourself. Alright. May I help you? Yeah, take book. Farewell. Find passage. Greetings. Take care of yourself. Greetings. Take care of yourself. What is this one here? <laughs> Never enough shouting runes, that's right. Gods be with you. Good boy. It's Hera's blessings. Joke. Um, you see, you don't have to speak to them to speak to the guy that will take you. Well, the next guy's on the way, I guess. Never enough stash tabs, just buy more. Although in solos, you, like, mm. when do you touch your stash tab? Well. Pull down. Hold down. Ah. 
Ah, oh, here we go. You're tabs no. at 300 across? Because you're a hoarder? Wow, oh, that's on you. I mean, I've actually become less of a hoarder because of playing P PoE. Um, I'm normally like a pick up everything and um, But from playing it, you just can't. But to me, it makes me actually get less loot in other regular RPGs, which is good because I just don't need that much stuff most of the time. I normally finish story RPGs like the, the richest person that, that that universe has ever seen. I think a lot of people end up like that, you know, like you just end up with so much gold from vendoring all the rubbish that Yeah. I never even go to a vendor. <laughs> and knowing this, um, the other week I I bought items in um, Dragon Age. I'm like, you know what, I've got heaps of money. I'm gonna go to the vendor and buy something. So I went to the vendor and bought these these Hello. these cool items and then immediately replaced them. Goodbye. With drops. <clears throat> Epoch is basically SSF. Yeah. They have a solo yeah. mode. <clears throat> so each character is like a league starter. It doesn't connect to your stash. Like, oh, sorry, each character gets their own stash, it's not an account stash. Yeah. Yeah. Yeah, I've only just started out with the loot filters. Stand down or die. This one's been working fairly well for me. There's definitely some modifications I make for uh, next time. Especially the stuff at the start was a bit There's too many items. Yeah, so what I did is I created the <laughs> the loot filter for this character. Um, and then I duplicated the filter. And then I've just been adjusting this one on the fly. You know, based on when I no longer need stuff. Um, <clears throat> and then when I get to the strict stuff at the end Stand of the game, it'll or be die. a knot. I think I can get a, a generic one that will get die. me started. But save, save a couple minutes at least. Where is that?
definitely here somewhere. <coughs> Turn to the stranded captain. Oh, that's right. I said <coughs> I should have come up to the middle. You were told not to come here. I wouldn't mind it another would cup of tea, actually. Yes. Yeah, in the story, you should go up the middle. First, <clears throat> I didn't remember that from yesterday. I remembered something different. Like, I'll go to the left one and kill that one. And pee time? No, I don't need pee time. Yeah. <laughs> it's doing such little damage. <laughs> That's so good. <laughs> so good. It'll get there. Okay, what are we spending in? 10, 5, 8, 1, 8. something else here okay I completely missed those almost an anomaly Put in there yet? Um, I'm gonna take the I'm just gonna portal to that part because I think that's where the quest item is. Yeah, where's the snacks? Where's the snacks, man? Or are you men without snacks as well? I didn't inspect the altars either. Pants. Wow, I'm doing terrible. I've lost the plot. Hello. Goodbye. Definitely man without snacks. The F word. <laughs> Only I didn't say fudge. <laughs> I want to make fruit with you. <laughs> oh man. One of the best bits of, um, you know, thinking about writing um, quality in that game. In that conversation with Dark, she says to us, you're going to have to speak to me later and it's going to be awkward. Um... And by the time you get to when you're going to speak to her, you get reminded of that. Um, it's after the Hardy Boys tell you the lie, which you don't know is a lie, about um, uh, her encounter with the deceased. And that's all you can remember is, I said that to her after that happened. 
you know, and she said it was going to be awkward, and it is. I'm supposed to go. Right, let's just run there. Where's this dude? Oh, he's up here, and he wants his um his eggs. some levels up here at this rate. Hurricane, oh, okay, that's going to be good. Yes, it is. But not yet. I'm going to check all of these at some point. <clears throat> yeah, that's not going up there. To make fruit <clears throat> with you. This doesn't have the same weight, not coming from the dude with the grin. Stand down or die. Down or die. Okay, this time examine the pool thingies. Pants. And. And go, ah, there's a quest item. That's one of the things that I wish you didn't have to do is. And I missed the thing from Path of Exile. We were, we were definitely um, treated to that one where you don't, um, you can go pick up the quest items before starting quests. And you try, you, it gets treated like you're out in the wild and you see something like, hey, that looks neat. I'll pick it up. Maybe I can use it later. But it definitely has some moments where it doesn't make sense, you know, if you're not looking for something, how do you know, you know what I mean? Like, you don't know what you're looking for. But... Ha! Stand down or die.
Playing aspect, it would make more sense to take things with you that are interesting. Some of it kind of makes sense, right? So the someone was saying yesterday, there's these. We're collecting the, these two half of circular bits of glass, I think they are, um, because there's these two pedestals, one on the left and one on the right. The room we were just in, yeah. and she and the girl that doesn't want to get us to get through, she broke them and hid the and hid them. So here's half of one now, right? So maybe when you first come through the zone, it's not there yeah. because she hasn't broken it yet, right? And I totally could get with that to say you've got to go into that room and have her fly in and be like, "Ha! I've just broken those, and you'll never find the the things." Right? But as soon as she's admitted to breaking them and hiding them, they should be hidden. I shouldn't have to look at the, you know, um, the pedestals to find out exactly what we're looking for. But maybe we, maybe you know, you could definitely, and the, I, I mean, I'm okay with it. But you could also have the, the argument could be made that we have no if we don't look at the pedestals we've got no idea what we're looking for. Um, so why are we going to be literally picking up every single piece of interesting stuff um, while traveling around the world killing enemies? Probably not. To the limit. Do, 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 Again. <laughs> Apparently, I don't know if the I think the fourth chapter is coming out at some point, and I don't know if I want to play it and then wait again for five, or if I just want to wait for five and play them both. Down, or wait for five to replay the whole thing. Yeah, I'm not replaying the whole thing. I don't want to go through that bear scene again. It was, but what can you do? Right, I'm going to check these items, because I think I can Good to be upgrade my loot filter after I do this. Right, can we wear, use this now? Okay, so we're on hurricane, we're on long swords now. Spell damage. Spell damage. I mean, I've got rhyme, I guess. Um, which means put swords. Here we go. We're up 
to engrave goblins of sparks. That's nice. Can I get some really good Haborians? Those are actually pretty good. They're the winners at the moment, I think. Extra Doge. Vendor dude, where's the vendor dude? Greetings. <laughs> You're really obsessed with the loot filter. The loot filter is good, man. It just goes from top, filters out from top to bottom. Um. Hmm. um. So the very bottom one is hide all items. Right, so anything that you're not looking for, hide the rest of them. And the ones at the top are, you know, that way it gets this color. And if it finds it on this one, it gets this color and then leaves. it gets placed on the ground and doesn't use the filter anymore. If it doesn't fit this set, but it fits this set, same deal. And that way when I saw the red ones, I got really excited because that was plus, at least plus one to my main skill. So it's now hitting for one level stronger than what it should be. Take care of yourself. It's really cool. Okay. Hands approves. It's in game. Like that's I think that's probably the best part. It's in game. So I can just change it. It automatically changes stuff on the ground. Can you look filter the shards? Yeah. I mean, the shards aren't that bad because you only have to pick up one that picks up all of them in a fairly large area. But if you loot filtered out the shards, you probably just, like, because quite often, like, because they're shards, I just pick up the one, I just pick them up when they're there, um, so I can deal with them later. And the ones that I don't need, you just don't use. Right? No, no big deal. But by not having them, I there'd be less time to you stop again, to pick up ones that you're again. never going to use. Yet you persist. If you wish for Lagan's temple to be your tomb, then so be it. Rune of Shattering on the ground. Nice.
twin dudes of that. They're raging. I just didn't see the door yesterday and I, I went around like that way like completely wrong direction and I think I ended up back at the start at some point that is a good idol has that got both? no it's only got one but I don't think it's as good as that one. Is that the really good one? No, it's only got one. I thought they had two things. Okay. Beat Lagoon with your Lich. Nice. Life drain is powerful, but sucks by mana fast. Okay. You like the easiest between builds. Yeah, you can. You just got to re-level up stuff, right? But especially the talents, like it costs just a little bit of gold to take points out of the tree and go back in again. Stand down or die. On softcore though, you may as well. If you've got, if you're enjoying the build you've got, you get. Stuff for another one, may as well just level another character. Maybe. Um. Yeah. I, don't, I definitely I don't want to be playing. Um, it might be different when they bring it out into um, actually having leagues, like Path of Exile. But I think having a... At the moment it feels like standard. Where you just end up with so much... You'd end up with like all these shards for... Um, for all these other builds you could make. You'd have so many. And you'd be able to get like... Um, starter weapons and carry right through and possibly even get like good gear um that's one of the things that like it's just a personal thing for me if you don't need to get any like do any of the kills and grind up the gear of the character because you've got it on a different character that you already have oh i didn't get out of the way of the slams i think there was was that twinned i think there was two of them it was it was twinned um are you even playing you know what I mean? Like, you might be playing leagues in Epoch. Fair enough then. But yeah, like if you get if you have all the gear, like if you get a high level character who gets all the gear that your next character needs, and all you got to do is level that character with leveling gear you've given them, and then you give them the best gear in the game that they could get because you've already earned it on someone else. What are you like? What are you even doing with that new character? But I think, like, where I see the value in it is for uh, people playing uh, hardcore characters. 
you know, you start farming up gear for your next character so that when the inevitable happens and your your hardcore character rips, yeah. you don't have to start from the beginning again. But you do have to start with a new character and you lose the best gear you were having. These guys are going to do me in because I don't have a move. Stand so. down or die. Lucky Box System Rides, you're playing Champs in Dark Alliance. Ooh, Dark Alliance. Um, reminded me about Dark Alliance. When's that releasing? I swear my armor is going to start to rust at this point. Speak I take on, no pleasure so in this. Mm. Your death shall be quick. Much easier than yesterday's character. It's unpredictable. I was trying to protect everyone. <clears throat> All right, Lagoon. <laughs> A10 Katava. This is gonna be hard because, yeah, no. do that.
Stuck there. I cannot do that. Class with no movements. <laughs> Why? I do appreciate that the you don't get to have, go run back in on the same health. Like you actually have to beat the boss, not just beat it by like beat it down in pieces. Started turning this way, I would have been screwed. I cannot do that. Is that the best you can do? What? I cannot do that. Is that the best you can do? Yeah. I cannot do that. <laughs> I cannot do that. Not do that. You are starting to bore me. Uh, I cannot do that. I cannot 
don't do that. Enough! I am not tired of this! Ha! Your skills entertain me, and for that you shall live. Now! I fight progress. Why have you come here? Blah 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 blah. That's why. I see. I see. Mm. Take care. Speak with Forgotten Knight and Thedema. Yes? Let's go. End of time time. 